there is a stereotype that uh, women are, like, in general, less knowledgeable when it comes to technical experience with technology. How do you think if there are more women among developers contributing to Bitcoin Core, mm -hmm. how would Bitcoin benefit from women entering? I do not think that women are worse developers than men. Uh, just, just to be clear, but it is, however, true that you know the society has been bringing up girls and boys differently. So boys got to get all the cool uh, gadgets and toys, while girls were the teddy bears and, and and dolls. Right? I always wanted to have a car, you know, and these small little like self-driving cars. Um, and sometimes my family would say, well, you're a girl, why don't you get a doll, right? So there is some cultural burden, basically, uh, on women, but uh, I've met so many smart and inspirational women in Bitcoin that it's hard for me to, to agree uh, with this. Yes, there's a smaller percentage of women involved, but that is natural in, uh, in the technological field. Eventually, when, you know, um, there is the, the core technology develop more and more women get access uh, in a way or they it gets their attention uh, you could we could dive into stereotypes such as is a woman less risk averse so do women like tend to wait a little bit more uh, until they step into something new uh, or does it take a more adventurous type of a woman to get into some completely new field we can only speculate on that, uh, but I, I also at the same time, as I said, Bitcoin is permissionless, and that also comes to like the open source. Um, anyone, anyone can start getting involved. I cannot code. I don't read code, and I'm involved in. Well, I got excited about Bitcoin in 2010, basically because it was exactly the form of better international money that I. I was looking for in my thesis. I was researching dollar and international monetary system and I was looking for something better and that was Bitcoin. So it got me excited on the economical and philosophical level, right? And then I got involved professionally and I brought in my experience from business development and sales relationships and stuff like that. And that's extremely valuable for companies in the Bitcoin space. So I, I would even say the the, 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 the necessity for women lies in the fact to balance uh, you know, the portfolio of skills in a company. And also it brings a little bit different vibe to the, to the uh, team. If you have 20 guys, that's great. Um, but then you, uh, then you have a few more women and all of a sudden the communication tends to be nicer, right? It just works like that. We have this like nice ma male to female, you know, there's there's a certain uh, level of more respect, I feel, um, or a different behavior kicks in. And so, for example, if, if you have a smart CEO in the Bitcoin space, you can also see that by the fact that he's surrounding himself with smart women. And the, the, the I think the female to male ratio in CASA uh, is pretty high. We have like 25% of our team is uh, female and we have several female female developers. Okay. And it, it feels great, it feels great. So it's just a choice, uh, you know, of course, as a, as a manager, you are choosing people with skills in the first place. You don't care whether it's a woman or a man. But at the same time, it has some additional bonus, you know, when, when, when the woman comes with her feminine energy into play. 